We present Surfer, an online non-volumetric dynamic reconstruction algorithm. Our pipeline takes input from a sequence of RGBD image, produces reconstructed geometry, and non-rigid motion as output. No prior information about the scene, like the geometric template or embedded skeleton, is required. We briefly compile dynamic reconstruction based tracking algorithm. Tracking uses pre-scanned template or embedded skeleton. However, a good initial alignment between the template and the observation is required. The alignment is usually problem-specific and not easy to obtain. Well, dynamic reconstruction estimates the geometry only. Of course, the estimated geometry is not as complete as an offline scan template, and the tracking is less robust. However, the setup and initialization is rather easy. The real-time, template-free dynamic reconstruction was first proposed by Dynamic Fusion. Later work extends the pipeline of Dynamic Fusion for improved robustness and capabilities. Although promising progress has been made, previous approaches rely on volumetric representation of the geometry and the deformation field. A smooth triangle mesh can be extracted from the volumes, but they are performance and memory intensive. In this work, we propose a dynamic reconstruction pipeline built on point or surface-based representation. Here, a surface is formally a local approximation of the surface. In our case, it is an oriented, sized point. We do observe substantial performance improvement in our experiment. Of course, the improvement comes from the elimination of volumetric fields and operations such as margin cubes or TSDF fusion. Here we present an overview of our pipeline. We maintain two several geometries. One is in the reference free, and the other is in the leaf free. The relative non-rigid motion is represented by a work field. Upon receiving a new dips image, the deformation field is estimated to align the leaf geometry with the dips observation. Here points from the dips image are in red, while points from the leaf geometry are in blue. After a successful alignment, the dips observation is fused into the leaf geometry to denoise and complete it, while the reference geometry is updated by inverse warping from the leaf geometry. Now the pipeline is ready for the next dips input. We discuss the challenge with close to open topology change, as shown in the illustration. Suppose there are two objects connected in the reference frame. The pipeline with all thematic information can only treat them as a single, large object. During tracking, the connectivity will be preserved and may cause tracking failure. Our approach resolves it using reinitialization similar to fusion forming. Again, this procedure is much more efficient in our volumetric free setup. Here we show more reconstruction examples. Besides, we continue to improve the pipeline with more capabilities. Here we present the reconstructed surface orbital in the next version of Surfer. The orbital can also enable photometric alignment and feature correspondence for better tracking. We have also made various improvements on the non-rigid tracker and the fusion pipelines towards efficient and robust online dynamic reconstruction. Thanks for your attention.